Well, we all know apps are very popular. But what happens when you combine apps with fast food, Kiba? All right, the answer, many would say it allows you to get your food even faster, right? Jeff, you have doubts about this. Mr. Cynic? How Jeff, lazy are we? That. Yeah. How lazy are we? Just with order fast it on your food, phone. all you have to do is just drive to the place, go to the drive through make your order, and you mm. get it. But now we have to get on an app and place our order beforehand have so we can get it a little faster. Us. Yes, have it waiting for us. Mm -hmm. No? Yeah. Well, Taco Bell now has an app, and this is how it works. And it takes customization to a whole new level. Burrito, see. <laughs> add some cheese, get rid of the tomatoes, add some guacamole. Why not? It's Saturday. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's easy. Love you can it. just get on the app and individually pick the items that you want on your tacos or burritos, and then you drive to the nearest location, walk into the establishment, and in theory, your food is there waiting for you, and you pick it up in a separate line from the others, so there's no wait. The app craze has also found its way into the hands of Dunkin' Donuts, Pizza Hut, Domino's, McDonald's, Dairy Queen, and Starbucks, just to name a few. There's a lot. <laughs> does it really save you a lot of time doing this? In my opinion, no, it does not. Maybe it shaves off a few seconds, but certainly not minutes. I think it more, makes more sense to do this with pizza because that way you're not on hold on the phone. You're not taking several minutes to place your order. You're actually uh, just ordering it on the app. You go in there uh, and pick it up or they deliver it uh, to you. That makes more sense to me than fast food, whereas you're spending your time on the app placing your order, uh, and during that time you could actually be driving to the place, not to mention instead of uh, waiting at the drive-thru, you have to actually get out of your car right. and walk inside. Yeah. So I, I don't think that it really saves Sounds like a taco hater to me. Much time. Well, I, don't know. <laughs> I like tacos. It yeah. makes sense because you just go through the drive-thru and get it done because as Jeff is saying, you have to do it and then go into the store. And who wants to do that? Right. Exactly. Yeah. You know, call me cynical, mm -hmm. but uh, there's no question that there are a lot of people downloading this stuff. These, these apps are being downloaded in huge amounts. Mm -hmm. So it's a generation thing, sure. you know, uh, and I'm part of that generation. You're just you know, at the 18 cusp to 34. Yeah. Just right. barely, right? Yeah. Yeah. Barely. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Chipotle has an school. app like that, and I've downloaded it, but I haven't used it. I'm just, I'd rather have a live person. Yeah. You know, even I had um, actually I ordered a this pasta dish from Chili's, but I wanted to I, I wanted to pick it up, but I wanted to call them. I don't want to go online. I just don't know where that's going. You're an old soul, though. That's yeah. True. Yes. That's yes. True. Yes. Yes. So you fit know. right in with me. And I love the idea of it, but I still like that human communication. But the other thing is, is you have to time it out because, uh, you know, I was thinking about the Starbucks app where, where now you can you can do that. Uh, you can order your coffee mm -hmm. on the app, go there and pick it up. You have to time it out, though. Sure. If it's, if it's hot cold? coffee, Wait. you don't want it to be cold, just like food. Wait. You know, you want your, your food to be relatively fresh, even if it's fast food. So, hmm. I don't know. We'll see. Old souls. He has spoken. <laughs> he has spoken, yeah. No, Thanks, it makes Jeff. sense, some of what you're saying. <laughs>